The XP80 contains an incredibly powerful synthesis engine, and this is able to control the sounds of the four tones within a patch completely independently. And we can set up completely different parameters for each tone. We can view the information in two different ways, however. Okay, user 001, patch West Coast. Let's go into the wave generator, F2, and then WG parameters. Now, this displays the associated parameters for tone one. And that's everything I need to know in this section on the display. However, if I want, I can go to the edit palette down here, F6, and view the same information in a different way. This time, the parameters for all four tones are displayed on the screen, and the information runs downwards. And we can scroll down the display to access the extra parameters that now won't fit on the display because of the extra tones. This is particularly handy because it allows us to compare the data for each tone. OK, well, to go back to the single tone view of the parameter settings, press F6 once again, and it takes us back to the currently selected tone, tone one. Now, some of the controls have very, very nice graphical representations of the parameters. These will not appear if you're using the edit palette mode. OK, but if you view each tone independently, then you get the pictures, pitch envelope, so on. So let's now take a more detailed look at the various parameters available.